All right, this problem, you are finding the solutions and then you're going to do the product. So it's a multi-step product on this. Now, if you look at this problem, you are going to try to get into this form, something times something equals zero. And you, and you kind of factor it. You, you do the factoring to get 12. So you, you might do 3x and x and then maybe three and two and then minus and minus maybe. So then I do negative three X, that will give me negative three X. This will give me negative six X. That gives me negative nine X. Um, no, I'm not getting the negative 12 X. Here's the thing. When you get a problem like this, it's just gonna be hard to find what X is. It just isn't working. If if it's obvious, I go ahead and do it. If not, what you do is you just simply do the quadratic equation. The quadratic equation can be used for any equation in this form, and it will work. Now, sometimes you don't need it because you can just look at it and figure out the factoring. But in this one, it's not so obvious. So this will always work. And so let's just do it. So if you're not familiar with this equation, this is what you use to figure out what X is. It gives you the X. So this is your A, this is your B, this is your C. So I'm just gonna fill in these coefficients for A, B, and C. All right, so negative B. So that's gonna be negative, negative 12. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and make that a positive. So I'm going to erase that because a negative and negative goes to a positive. Plus or minus the square root b squared, which is 12. 12 squared is 144. Minus 4ac. 4 times 3 times 6 because you got your a and your c. All right, all over 2a. So 2 times a, which is three. All right, now I'm gonna simplify this. 12 plus or minus the square root of 144 minus four times three is 12. 12 times six is 60 plus 12, 72. All over six. All right, now 12 plus or minus the square root, and I got to do 144 minus 72. I don't trust my brain, so I'm just going to go to the side over here and subtract. All right, and I get 72. All right. Now all over 6. All right, now at this point, you're looking to figure out uh, the, the square root of 72 you can't do. Well, you could do, but it's going to be a big decimal. So you can't do this. So then you look for ways that you can break the 72 up into a square number times something else. So if you kind of look at it, 72 is actually 36 times 2. And you can do the square root of 36. So here's what you do. You do 12 plus or minus, and then you do the square root of 36 is 6, and that goes outside. Square root of 2 all over 6. Now, this is where it gets kind of nice. I'm going to divide the 6 into each thing in the top. And you've got to divide it into each one for it to be legal. So 6 goes into 12 two times, plus or minus. 6 into 6 is 1. So it's just 2 plus or minus the square root of 2. All right. Now, that is what x is equal to. But that's not what it's asking. It's asking for what's the product of your solutions. So now you've got to multiply these two together to get it. So your, you know, your problem's not over yet. All right, I'm going to erase all of this. I'm going to write down x is equal to 2 plus or minus the square root of 2, so I don't forget that. All right, and I'm going to erase this just to create some room here. All right. Now, I got to do 2 plus the square root of 2 times 2 minus the square root of 2, because product is times. 
Uh, the plus or minus just means it's two solutions. One's two plus this, one's two minus this. All right, so now I'm not going to do anything tricky here. I'm just going to go ahead and multiply everything. So two times two is four. Two times negative square root of two is minus two square root of two. All right, square root of two times two is plus two square root of two. Square root of two times the negative square root of two is minus two. Now, this actually turns out kind of nice. N minus two square root of two and two square root of two goes to zero, so it goes bye-bye. And then four minus two is two. And lo and behold, we get a kind of a whole number, or kind of a, a number that's not expected considering this, this whole thing looked like it was gonna be a mess. So there you have it.